Lisa Fernandez joins us again now. Lisa, this is amazing news for Boff. He's spoiled for choice. He certainly is. And you know what? Let's not forget that there are lots and lots of dogs, Tim, uh, like Wolf, that are looking for homes. But, you know, thanks to our Channel 9 viewers that have emailed in because he is he should not be here. That's the bottom line. He should not be in a pound. He should be with a family who loves him. Uh, but, you know, Tim, not everyone does want a big dog, OK? I get that. I'm a big dog lover. So what we're going to do next is pretty special. There are another couple of dogs in the pound. They're smaller than Boof. They've been there for... Tim, they've been, hit, they've been in the pound almost a year. It's, it's really heartbreaking. And I'm going to introduce you to these two dogs that also need homes. Uh, their names are Kimba and Taco. I'm going to bring them out next and hopefully, fingers crossed, we might be able to do something really special this morning and find these three beautiful rescue dogs a home. You can email in. It's todayperth9, number nine, at nine.com.au um, please email in if you're interested uh, or if you know someone that might be because that would be wonderful if at channel nine we could find these three gorgeous dogs a home so coming up next you're going to meet taco and kimba if anyone can find them a home i reckon you can lisa hey, time to go back to lisa fernandez now the dog whisperer lisa <laughs> you've found some more hounds in need of a good home <laughs> okay tim it's my mission this is kimba for those who uh, don't want such a big dog as Boof, uh, Kimba has been rescued by Desperate for Love Dog Rescue and she's been in kennels for almost a year. She's playful. I'll tell you a bit about her. She's playful. She's fun. She loves the beach. Uh, what else can I tell you? She gets on with cats and dogs and she would probably need an active owner. Now, we have run these dogs, so they were pretty active. But look at this. I mean, this dog does not need to be in a kennel at all, aren't you? You're you're a good girl. Good. Oh, God. How many times have I... I have had more kisses from dogs than I've had from blokes all year. Anyway, and um, this is Taco, all right? Now, Taco, I'm going to be honest with you. He is mischievous. He is a firecracker. He is fun. He's playful. We let him out and he literally raced around the whole dog kennels, didn't he, Clara? He did, yeah. Staring up the dogs. Tell us why Taco needs a home. Come Taco on. needs a home because he's just cheeky. He's little. He's adorable. Playful. And He's what, been in here for a long time. <laughs> I mean, and what will happen to these dogs if they don't find homes? They just stay in they here. They stay in kennels, yeah. Yeah. They mean, really need a home. We don't. I mean, he's just so lovely. So maybe for someone that doesn't want such a big dog, wants a smaller dog, he will need some training. Um, but you know what? He's fun. He's got a personality. He wears his own jacket to bed. And um, he lies in there. Oh, he's too cute. You can put him down now, Claus. That's all right. And he can run around a bit. But look, Tim, um, you've got the info there about emailing us. We would love to find these dogs a home today, yeah, if possible. On, Channel 9 viewers. Lisa, I reckon you might have met your match there with uh, Taco. I reckon he might be going home with you. <laughs> well, he's kissed me enough times, <laughs> so you never know. There you go. It's the start of a beautiful thing. <laughs> It certainly is, Tim. Like, I'll be coming back to the station with my new boyfriend. Yeah, awesome. look forward to uh, um, you introducing so, him. Look, can, we <laughs> <laughs> can we get emailing, please? Um, because we want to find these rescue dogs a home today, and especially Boof. So come on, Channel 9 viewers, we can do it. Back to you, Tim. All right, good on you, Lisa. Thank you.